Neil Young has so many just incredibly cool tunes. This is a very early one. First came out on uh, the Buffalo Springfield second album in 1967. This is of course Broken Arrow. Uh, the version we're gonna we're gonna talk about playing it like that now, although which is how he did it more in 1968 when he went out solo. And uh, the album I really encourage you to listen to for all kinds of other songs. Just a great show is called Sugar Mountain live at the Canterbury House in 1968. So. Um, and there's, it's just really neat to hear him do solo versions of a lot of songs that were done with a little bit more production in other, uh, other incarnations. So the interesting thing about this song is it's, it's very flexible in the timing. It changes. Some of it's in 4-4 four, four time, some of it's in 3-4. We might think of it as 3-8. It doesn't really matter. And the beats do not stay the same. The speed of the beats. Sometimes when he goes into 3, if we think of it as 3-4, they're going to be moving a little faster than they were in 4-4 four, four time. Anyway, the, so you might be able to figure this out, even without the chart, having just heard and seen what, what, what went on there. You could also take a look at the chart that I've included here, and that does show you at least the chords, and by listening, you should be able, might be able to figure out the rhythm, what's going on. So uh, before you go into the, the detailed breakdowns, actually it's not going to be too much of a breakdown on this. Uh, we're just going to talk about 3-4 time, 4-4 four, four time, and some strumming things that happen in there. And But anyway, see what you can do on your own first, and then take a look at uh, whatever amount of the instruction you're going to need from the rest of this lesson. <laughs> 